So hey folks, we're out again on the bike and uh, we're just out doing a couple of uh, jaunts really. Um, needed a couple of things. Uh, one, I needed some duct tape inside my helmet. Um, the wires for my intercom and the cameras and things uh, keep getting dislodged and then uh, pushing against my head and also in my ears and things like that. So uh, what I need to do is get some duct tape, uh, which I've picked up and I'm going to tape all the wires inside the helmet so they don't uh, move. Now, um, also we're actually uh, going to Walling's Ice Cream, which I've mentioned in another video. And I know one of my subscribers, David, um, said he was going to make a trip there. So, uh, yeah, it's Saturday and uh, that's where I'm going to get an ice cream in this uh, heat wave that we've got today. So we're just heading up uh, the Lyon Valley Road and uh, we're just going to basically do a little detour around towards Wallings. So what's everyone been up to in the week? Um, it's been an uh, extremely busy week and uh, it's nice to see the sunny weathers come out. And uh, I've also just finished watching the uh, MotoGP and the qualifying. And uh, man, the Silverstone's really uh, stepped it up this year with that surface. And uh, also all of the uh, top riders are saying how good it is. And uh, it certainly shows in the, uh, the lap times and the lap records that have been smashed this time. Yeah, so the MotoGP, um, really, really exciting stuff. A lot more interesting than Formula One and um, I'm just uh, thinking what I need for my trip tomorrow. So a few of you had done the poll that I uh, put up on YouTube about whether to go to uh, the MotoGP at Silverstone or to go to uh, Wales uh, this weekend. So in the end uh, most of you voted, I think it was 80% that voted uh, to go to Wales so uh, Myself and a friend of mine, Mark, are heading off at about 9.30 tomorrow morning. And then what we'll do from there, we'll actually uh, go towards Langollen and then towards Lake Bala. So just down here is the village of Dolphin Home. Yep, you heard it right, Dolphin Home, the home of dolphins. Here's the signpost, uh, Dolphin Home, a picture of a dolphin. God knows who named this village, but uh, lovely little village. And uh, we're just passing through now on our way to the, uh, the ice cream, which is what's needed on a day like today. So yeah, Wales. Um, what we're going to do is, uh, like I said, head off in the morning. We'll head towards Langollen, then up towards Lake Bala. Uh, we'll have some lunch in Lake Bala about one o'clock. Hopefully I'll get a chance to watch the uh, Moto GP on my phone or something. And uh, after that we're going to head round Lake Bala and uh, right the way around the mountain and uh, potentially take in the mountain road that comes across the top back to Lake Bala, which is an absolute cracker, so stay tuned for that. So the video will be uh, probably uploaded on Monday uh, with it being a bank holiday and we won't actually get back from um, Wales till um, late afternoon or early evening tomorrow night. Um, so that episode will be coming up on Monday. And uh, yeah, what's everybody up to this weekend? It's uh, an absolute belter weather-wise. Uh, currently it's 28 degrees here up in Lancashire. need to get past the farmers with it being such a rainy uh, weeks uh, beforehand basically the farmers are out in force today okay so we're just going to turn left here onto the A6 and just head down a little bit There's a right turn coming up just here, and this will take us and get signposted towards Cockerham. And uh, a few miles up here, we'll actually turn left 
onto the uh, the Cockburn Road, which will uh, then take us to Walling's Ice Cream. So we're just going to go over the canal here that runs all the way up to Lancaster. And then uh, a couple miles down this road we'll be turning left towards Walling's Ice Cream. Okay, so just at the junction here, turn left and then uh, a couple miles down the road and uh, we're there. Now I'm expecting it to be busy today, uh, with it being so hot and uh, obviously a bank holiday weekend. Um, but they do great service this place, and uh, even if there's a queue, it's never normally uh, too long. But uh, let's see, it's just on the right here. Yeah, so there's a queue, and uh, it's out the door, but it uh, shouldn't take uh, too long to get in to get an ice cream. So as you pass through... Uh, Walling's just here, you've got a car park at the back, um, so plenty of parking spaces and also there's some benches and things out by the fields. I think there's some wildlife and wild stock that they have out the back there, um, but we're just going to come back round and uh, back into the front car park. I spotted a space that we can pull into. So I'll pop it just here. So Walling's ice cream, here we are. And uh, let's go inside and see what they've got. Okay, so that was Walling's ice cream. Had a uh, really nice uh, one scoop waffle cone, which was about two pounds. And uh, their one scoop is about uh, six scoops, by the way. Uh, so as you saw by the cone and the uh, the ice cream, very large, great price, couple of quid. And uh, the queue that I was in literally took two minutes to get to the counter. Brilliant service. Uh, from Walling's ice cream, plenty of staff on, and uh, yeah, it was all very nice. Uh, there's some seating at the uh, the front, just there, and also around the back, there's some outdoor seating as well as the cafe inside. There's got uh, cakes galore, and uh, teas, coffees, and some uh, food and uh, drink and stuff. Um, so yeah, um, it's uh, just near Cockerham, and. Um, I'll have put a map up at the start of the video, uh, but that's Walling's Ice Cream. Just give them a Google and uh, you'll find them pretty easy. And if you're heading towards um, Glass and Dock, then basically uh, Glass and Dock uh, is in the same area and also Knot End. So uh, just be careful of these tractors, guys. Um, it's a uh, bank holiday weekend. They've had rain for ages and uh, they're all trying to get the fields mowed, so uh, stay careful out there and uh, beware of farm machinery on these country lanes. It's crazy at the moment. So we've just come to Cockerham, and uh, we're just going to turn right just here, head towards Lancaster now, and uh, this road will take you actually towards the road that goes down to Glaston Dock, a little further ahead. So, uh, yeah, uh, Walling's Ice Cream, um, brilliant place. They uh, make the all their own ice cream. Uh, as you saw in the pictures, I think they've got about 40 or 50 different flavors. And, um, yeah, really, really good place. Um, 
If you're going with the kids, I would recommend uh, getting them a very, very small cone, as they're all large. And uh, basically, uh, when I take my little girl there, um, she can't finish it all anyway, so uh, at least you get good value for money. Not like that uh, ice cream that I tried to get up in uh, the Lake District, I think it was Ambleside. And they were trying to charge me £4.50 for something that I didn't ask for. So, Yeah, so we're just past the um, Glass and Dock Road. And then we've got the Stork just ahead of us here. If you uh, do turn left at the Stork, just down that road just there. Um, basically, you come to the uh, Deloon Cafe, which I featured in the Cafe Series Episode 1. So, hope you've liked the video. Um, you may have noticed that the uh, sound's a little off um, today, and that was basically because the uh, the last video that I made coming from uh, the Wheelie World Championships, my microphone packed in in my helmet, the one that I talked through, and uh, I thought it had just come unplugged, but uh, unfortunately, when I went out to make this video today, um, basically the microphone is knackered so um, I didn't find out till I came to edit the video so uh, literally I'm sat on the sofa um, with my new setup and microphone in my helmet with my helmet on in the sofa to try and make it sound as though I'm on the bike um, so the other mic was working as you can hear with the uh, sound from the motorcycle it was just the helmet mic that packed in so uh, do apologise, it's all fixed now and uh, it'll be good to go for the uh, Wales trip tomorrow. So, um, if you're new to the channel, you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe. Give this channel a like, uh, all helps, and I'll catch you on tomorrow's video, which will be Wales, uh, Snowdon, and also that will be edited and uploaded for Monday for you. So. Have a great weekend and uh, catch you soon. If you like the videos, please subscribe and hit the bell button for regular reminders of new videos coming up.